Hi, Mary. So things are trending drier, and that is helpful because with this haze, you know, it yeah, it's a little was a little dicey, especially with the clouds that we were getting from a disturbance to our south. But it's looking better for us. So still kind of hazy as we take a live look at Central Park right now. We've got that haze-filled sky. It's 70 degrees though in the park with winds out of the north northeast at just five miles an hour. So just a light breeze. Things are warming up pretty nicely. We're at 64 degrees in the Bronx, but 71 for Jackson Heights and for Sheepshead Bay. 69 in the Battery, but 70 for Staten Island. Newark is at 74 degrees. So it is warming up nicely today. It's mild across the board. Uh, 63 for Greenwich, Connecticut. 63 for the Hamptons. White Plains at 69. All the other locations on this map are in the 70s, which is nice. Do you want to talk pollen? Got to talk about it. Tree pollen is moderate. Grass is moderate. It may not sound like a win, but it felt like for weeks tree pollen was extreme. So this is an improvement. Ragweed, weeds, and mold are all low right now. So we are in for a day that features, yes, uh, hazy conditions, but also very mild conditions. So for a lot of people, that is definitely reason to get outside. Your satellite and radar is pretty quiet. Quiet. Uh, we are looking at mostly clear skies. Of course, the hazy conditions make it seem like maybe it's not quite as sunny as it really is, but it, it is. You want to protect your skin for sure. And we are keeping an eye on this cold front. So we're watching this front. Uh, this morning, it was firmly into Canada. Now it is pushed into northern upstate New York. And basically what we're looking at is along that frontal boundary, we're seeing clouds, but we also see some showers, possibly some embedded thunderstorms with this easternmost section. I mean, it's a pretty large front, but we're only concerned with the portion that it's going to move through the tri-state area. So as we time this out on future cast, you'll see a couple of things. One is a definite increase in cloud cover as the front uh, pushes south, but also a chance for rain. So we turn this on. This is 4.30 in the afternoon. It's been fairly consistent, showing us uh, a lot of activity up around uh, Kingston, uh, heading into parts of Connecticut. So seeing a lot of activity around 4.30, and then seeing, in some cases, more of those cells with the moderate, even heavy downpours around Sparta. Uh, parts of Westchester County, parts of Fairfield County in Connecticut, and then starting to weaken a bit as it pushes toward and through New York City uh, later in the afternoon, early into the evening moving across Long Island. And then this particular model is showing, you know, Monmouth and Ocean County actually seeing some rain as well. But so it is a possibility for all of the tri-state area late this afternoon through this evening behind the front, cooler temps, but also clearer skies. So Thursday should be looking pretty good, Friday too. Um, and as far as how much rain we get, not a lot is the short answer. Like two tenths of an inch for a lot of the area, if that, there are some Belmar, Toms River, Montauk picking up little to nothing. So for today, a touch warmer at 76 degrees. Keep the umbrella handy. With that uh, front passing, we do have a chance to see some showers. And then tomorrow, sunny and cooler at 68 degrees. Mary? Looks wonderful, Elise. Thank you.